so boom hey guys it's shirai welcome back to my channel and if you're new here welcome my name is shirai and yeah enjoy the video game we lit damn um so before we want i need to get a new chair before we get into the video what you want to do is hit the subscribe button and click the bell to turn on all your post notifications so you never miss the time that i upload and like i said join the video game we lit we are almost at 5k you guys i remember making my goals and i was just like i wanted to try to get the bitty gang to 5k by the end of spring beginning of summer and it looks like we are on the right track i checked youtube earlier and it said i was at 4501 subscribers so i'm like oof i am 500 subscribers away from my goal and i cannot believe it, it is so lit i am so excited i'm so happy and i'm just so thankful to everybody who supports me who joins the bitty gang and watches my videos and yes i love you so 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 much and i just cannot thank you guys enough i have other goals and plans for this channel i just you know i want to reach certain milestones before i start doing certain things and yes please stay tuned and like i said join the bitty gang that is what i call my subscribers if you're new to this channel this is my gang my family my it's 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 crazy but as you can see by the title today i did a fashion overhaul and um i wanted to get some more like workout clothes and the only thing that really bothers me like always is that they never have my size when it comes to certain things or when things come out and you know i want to get something is never in my size and i get upset but luckily for me i don't really i'm not the type of girl to work out like oh my workout set has to match you know i'm usually in a t-shirt and some leggings or a sports bar and some sweats or something like that like that's me so yeah if you know you're looking for i do have a, a set on here but everything isn't matching because it's never they don't come as sets and that really bothers me because it's like somebody can go ahead and you know order one piece and next before you know all these pieces are left over and you can never really match anything luckily i don't like sets anyway that come together as a set because my bottom is big different from my top my tops are one two x my bottoms is like a three x so that really never works but I am going to show you guys what I got and hopefully when you get on there, you know, you can find it. Starting off, I'm going to go ahead and start off with this lilac bra right here. And this bra is called the At Ease Active Sports Bra in Power Flex. And this is in the color lilac. Um, this was originally $19.99. I found a coupon code, got it for $14.99. And like I said, I got this in a 2X and I really like it. And one thing I was really looking for was sports bras that had a white band at the, like at the bottom of it. Because if you know, and you're plus size and you have rolls and things like that, you know, the sports bras just be cutting into your rolls and it never really covers it. This one I like because it comes, it comes down far enough to cover my back rolls. The only thing I just don't like is the fact that they said that this is considered a high impact bra and it's not i actually tried just jump roping because that's what i sometimes do i've been slacking but you know i was jump roping and i realized that my bra it, it just it wasn't holding the girls and i am a 40 double d and yeah this wasn't really high at high impact um if you like you know, if you want to do walking or you're just in the gym just to weight lift and you're not really doing so much running and jogging, then this bra would be good. It's really kind of just for show. Like, hey, I got, you know, it, I, that's what I feel like. It's kind of just for show. And that's what I would consider. I would consider this like low impact. Like it's really, there's nothing to it, sadly. So, you know, if you're looking for a high impact bra that's really going to hold you, then I would not recommend this because this isn't it. It's cute and it covers. It just doesn't hold anything. And that's pretty much the downfall I have with that one. I also got it in black, but I'm currently wearing it right now. And like I said, I do like the fact that the band is wide enough to cover my back rolls and stuff. Sometimes it does roll up, but that's for the most part, 
it covers it and yeah like I said if you want to do walking or if you're weightlifting and you're not doing too much motion then these bras will really be good for you and for $14.99 I feel like it's not bad especially if you need something to go in the gym in and you don't really like wearing long sleeves and things like that I know sometimes I don't want to stay in my hoodie so like I will wear a hoodie because for some reason I sweat easily now like it's crazy at first it would take a lot to break a sweat and now I sweat easy if I don't wear my hoodie I would probably just take my hoodie off and I'll just wear this bra do what I gotta do and then get out or if I'm walking then I would wear it and you know over here I'm in Merlin it's beginning to be the summertime so it's hot so I'm not walking outside with a hoodie on promise you I'm not and yet yeah, they also had these um bra pads in them but after i washed my bras literally the first time one came out it is a hole on the side if you want to remove them or put them back in i chose to take them out because it's like i got tired of always trying to you know make sure the padding was in there right to cover it so i was just like yeah i'm just going to take them out but i still have them in case i did decide to put them back in i really doubt it but yeah so i got the you know, I got it in lilac and I also got it in black. And the black one was the same price. Well, originally, sorry, I'm looking at my screen because I couldn't find the paper. It was originally $19.99, but like I said, I did I did get it on sale and I got it for $14.99. So I feel like, you know, that price for bra is not bad. You kind of get what you pay for in this situation. Moving on, I did have a piece to go that actually matches my black bra. And it is uh, these spandex shorts right here. And these are the At Ease Active Biker Shorts and Power Flex. And these are in, um, obviously, black. And I do like them. They're really soft. They're really, really, really stretchy. I almost wish I got a 2X. But at the same time, I'm kind of glad I didn't. Because I feel like they fit just right. Um, I haven't worked out in these whatsoever. But obviously, like, if, on the screen, I did do, a, like, two squats in them just to show you guys. So it has a pretty good hold. Uh, I really wanted something with like little side pockets because when I am at the gym I don't have really nowhere to put my phone and I do wear my headphones and they're wireless So I don't have nowhere to put my phone sometimes and that can get annoying But you know they seem like they're very stretchy and they're durable and they're not see-through So I kind of like that some people do you know have gym clothes and they're black But they see through like when they you know bend over and stuff like that and I don't think that's cute whatsoever but I was even lucky to even to even find these. I tried to find the um I can't talk. I tried to find a biker shorts to go with the lilac bra, but they didn't have it in my size, and I was kind of nervous on getting a 2X. So now I'm like now that I actually put them on, I'm kind of glad I did it. But I just haven't worn these yet because I just been trying to really sweat and stuff lately. And I realized when I wear sweat clothes, which <laughs> sweat clothes, I sweat. So that's usually what I wear to the gym. I'll probably wear like a t-shirt. And something like that. Like, I'll be trying to look cute when I go to the gym, y'all. I promise I don't. Like, I might match, but I don't be trying to look cute. Like, I just, I, I need to sweat more and, you know, get things rolling. Um, the shorts, well, I'll put the price of the shorts on the screen. And, yeah, if you know Fashion Over, you know there's always a discount code somewhere. So, you really don't have to worry about actual prices. They're always doing sales or it's always in the discount code, affiliate code somewhere roaming around so please try to look for that before you decide to buy things for a price because yeah hopefully those shorts though hopefully they don't you know like ride down and stuff like they uh stuff like these pants do which i'm going to show you guys next these pants actually are right here and these are the make it happen active legging and sculpt tech this is in the color heather gray and i got these in a 2x and I'm kind of glad I did. <laughs> like, these ones are way, like, they're way more stretchier than the shorts. They are breathable. And I did like the fact that they have side pockets. So, I mean, the pocket's not that deep. And as you can see, like, I do have a um, big phone. I have a 12 Pro Max. And, yeah, like, it's just a little, it's a little pocket full of something, something. But I got these in a 2X. They're very, very stretchy. I did actually wear these to the gym. I wore these with my lilac bra, I believe. And I think... Yeah, I wore these in my lilac -like bra to the gym because I wanted to test how these would do, like, how these would do in the gym. And I can't lie to you guys, like, like I said, I sweat. So, when I finished at the gym and I was looking in the mirror, you know, it's sweat. I had, like, a sweat crack. And you can actually see it. And it's like, I get it, it's a gym, but at the same time, like, if these are supposed to be 
you know, water res if these are supposed to be sweat wicking, then you know, I shouldn't, you know, it should be able to trap the sweat in here. But sadly, I don't sweat that hard, but I do sweat a little, obviously. Like, I don't be drenched in sweat, but I do sweat for you to see it. Like, these, you can see it all through, you can see it all throughout the leggings. So, well, it was really in my crack, because I usually sweat TMI, but it was in my butt crack, and you could see, like, that sweat line, and I was like, ooh, this is not cute. But, I, and it's crazy, because I have other leggings that don't do that, so these ones, I wouldn't, I would say these are not sweat wicking leggings. I do like the design of them. And they do stay um, in place for, you know, like walking and things like that. But when it comes to running and jumping, these will fall down. They will fall down. Because when I left the gym, I came home and I jumped rope in them because I was trying to test them out before I decided to do a video on them so I can give you guys my honest opinion. And these kept falling. I had to stop jumping to pull my leggings back up just to keep jumping. So, like, I... Just like the bras, if you want something that's very, you know, low impact and something just to do minimal movement in, then these are okay. But besides that, if you're trying to jog and run and do things like that, for me, being plus size is not going to work. And yeah. On to the next thing. I have my shorts here. And these are sweat shorts. I actually got two different colors, but they both fit different. Uh, these are the pink ones, and these shorts. Ooh. And these shorts are called the Legacy Folded Hem Active Shorts, and this is in mauve. I said pink, pink mauve. This is what they look like. I got them in the three. Yeah, I got both of these in a 3X. Um, I do like the band on them. I, I like shorts and sweatpants that have like that wide band on it. For some reason, it just grabs my waist different. Comment below if you know what I'm talking about. So when it comes to wide band things, they just, they grab my waist different and it makes me, I don't know. It kind of brings out my shape a little bit, so I kind of like them. Uh, these shorts are looser than my other ones and I did get them in, in uh, damn, I can't even talk. I did get them in the same size, so they're both a 3X. It's crazy because if I had the pink ones, the pink ones I would size down to a 2X. But, you know, it's okay. I have a little bit more wiggle room in here. And they are sweat shorts. And believe me, like, when I wore them and I was getting, like, I was moving and stuff like that. I was sweating. So, I was like, all right, you know. They're doing their job as they should. As what I got my money for. And, yeah. The other ones are uh, cream colored. Sorry. I was about to say beige. These are definitely cream colored. And just like the, you know, the mauve ones, should I say. Because I got to use the color mauve it's not pink it's mauve 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 i don't know <laughs> but yeah these are them and um you know just like the other ones they do sweat they are sweat shorts and i do be sweating in them so i kind of like it and yeah like i like just the feel of them it, to be honest i was like ooh. These cream ones, I probably wouldn't wear to the gym because I feel like, I don't know. Like, I don't like wearing little, like, short things. But my pink ones, I would wear them if I'm doing, like, basic stuff in it. But these ones, since they fit a little tighter, I would probably just wear these, like, if I'm going out somewhere or just, you know, on a regular day in the spring or the summer. And, you know, pair it with, like, a cute shirt or something. Pink ones, I probably would too. But, you know, the I don't think I would wear these ones to the gym because they're just a little too tight for me personally to be able to do all my things and still be okay like yeah because these like i said these are three x as well but they fit a little bit tighter but i did like them these shorts did come in other colors but the only colors i was able to grab was this cream color and the mauve color and yeah they came in mauve cream gray black and white i wasn't doing white sound cute white clean but I was mad because the, the, the Heather Gray ones were so cute and the Black ones were too. Because, you know, you can't go wrong with shorts for the summer or, you know, shorts for the gym, whatever the case is. Like I said, I like wearing joggers and leggings to the gym. But definitely I like the shorts just to have a different feel some days. And yeah. So the um, pants I have on now, but obviously I can't show you guys. These are called the Anna, Annalisa joggers and they were... Uh, I got them in a 2X. My joggers, I always get in a 2X. I don't get them in a 3X because I did order joggers before the 3X. And they kind of like that oversized feel. So, I didn't want to have, you know, that kind of oversized look with these ones. And, yeah, I really like them. The only thing that I really just don't like about them is the fact that um, I have worn them and washed them. So, 
I wore them three times now, so they've been washed a few times. And I have like the little ballies in between my thighs, of course. Thick thigh girls, thick thigh problems. Um, I also don't like the fact that they have they don't have side pockets. So it feels weird because I can't put like my hands in my pockets and I'm one of those girls that sometimes walk around with their hand in their pockets. But I mean they are back pockets and then also I realize when I take them off I be having like the um, red fuzzies from inside the joggers on my legs and stuff. So when I go to the bathroom I be like why is there like red stuff on my thighs and it's coming from my pants so just be mindful of that. Um, you know it's kind of you kind of get what you pay for and the joggers more sorry they uh weren't expensive should i say so um those are just a couple key notes the the thigh ballies i feel like that's gonna be every thick girl problem but is it sad that it happened like that like it it started like literally after the first time i worn them and like walked around i think i ran errands in them and i came back and i was like dang like i got you know, balls between my legs already which kind of sucks but it's it's a risk I'm not going to say a risk. It's just something that happens when your thighs are always rubbing together and stuff like that. But for the price, you couldn't beat it. They are cute. I just wish that they had side pockets. And it's kind of my fault because it's like I was trying to be different. I was like, okay, these joggers, you know, I have a lot of pair. I have a lot of joggers. But I like these joggers don't have side pockets. So let me see how it is. And I don't like it. <laughs> so if you're a girl who like has to have pockets, then these definitely wouldn't be it for you. So these next pair of joggers I had, these are the Sports Legend side rib joggers. So they have, you know, this little, they have the ribs on the side. Also, like, they are black. And, you know, like I said, I like things that have the wide band on them because it just grabs my waist different. They don't have back pockets, but they do have side pockets. Because, like I said, I need pockets. Um, As far as the black goes, it kind of... It's already faded and I wore all my joggers quite a few times and I've did a certain amount of activities with them. Just like I said, I wanted, you know, to give you guys a honest review before I just came on here and showed you guys like what I actually have because, you know, it's active line. Um, just like, just like my other pants, you are going to get, I don't know if you guys can see that, but I have like, like little fuzzy balls between the legs. I don't know if you guys, it's not really picking up on camera, but see there we go so you know you're gonna have fuzzies and stuff excuse the dog hair i have fur babies but um yeah and that happened after a couple times it didn't this didn't ball up as easier as my red ones but they definitely do get balls and like i said it just sucks but that's something you gotta really deal with but you know for the price you couldn't beat it i really like these they're black they're basic um I got my pockets and I tried to reach for them too much, but I'm, I find myself always wearing black, but I was like, I need to have more joggers for the gym. They do make me sweat, which is really good. Um, as far as activity and stuff, they don't really fall, but I, I, you know, I have a drawstring anyway and I do tie my joggers. So they're not falling like my leggings would. And yeah, they're like really, really comfortable. And they, all my joggers I got in this haul are very comfortable and they were not expensive at all. And like I said, you can always find a discount code somewhere. Getting to my next pair of joggers, I have these burgundy ones right here. And these are the Sports Essential Joggers. Obviously, this is in a color burgundy. Same thing with the band. I like them. They're also, you know, they're also stretchy. I got them in a 2X because like I said, I got 3X before and I just didn't. It was just too big, so I wanted something more fitting, but with movement, and you know, I do move around a lot with these joggers on, and I had to get a burgundy pair because I was just like, mm, I don't have one, and I be sweating like crazy. Like I don't sweat a lot, but these joggers definitely make me break a sweat real easy. So I kind of like that, and I just like how I look in them. I like how I look in joggers just in general. And, um, yeah, I just like them. I really like how on the back pocket it says Nova Sport on there. I thought that was really cute. And I think it is only, yeah, it's only one back pocket on the right side. So, you know, I look cute in my little jog as while I'm working out. And I look very nice. And I really like them. And, yeah, getting into my last pair, I got the same joggers, the, uh, the Sports Essential Joggers. And this is in the color cream. Same color as my shorts. Um, these ones I don't really wear too much because they're very light and I got something on them and I don't know what it is I don't know if you guys can really see that but 
it's like something black so i tried to wash it out it's not trying to it come it came out a little bit but it's faded on there so this is why i don't wear light colors but um yeah just the same feel i didn't wear these to the gym because i'm honestly scared to i feel like i'm dirty them up so these are just like more so some everyday joggers and that i probably just keep around but like i said this with the other ones i have the back pocket i have the side pockets and i look i i wore these before but i just didn't wear them to the gym i just paired it with some black running shoes and a black shirt and i went on about my business i probably won't wear these to the gym but my other ones i definitely do wear to the gym i also have more joggers but it's not in this haul if you guys want to see that haul i did it in the winter time so i'll leave it in a note card or i'll just put the link down below and yeah also that's how you guys i got everything on my joggers in the 2x i think i did i think so if not everything is on the screen and yeah so um that's pretty much all i have for this haul i wish i could have got more active pieces but sadly they just weren't in my size and it sucks but it's okay it is okay as long as i take myself to the gym i'm fine as long as i get to the gym i'm fine I don't, like I said, I'm not really worried about what I really look like in the gym. Like, I'm not one of those girls like, oh, this got to match. I got to look a certain way. No, I'll be in the gym with a hat on, my headphones, minding my business. But, yeah. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to like, comment. Most importantly, subscribe to the video game. Yes, yes, yes. Follow me on Instagram at underscore I am Shariah. And I will see you guys next video. Bye.